Where did this philosophy come from that says millions of years slow processes? 咁呢个几千万年同埋一个好慢嘅过程，呢、这个哲学系由边度而嚟咧 ？It was imposed upon geology by a man called Lyell. 就由赖尔将呢个哲学套入去地质学里边。He was a lawyer who lived in Darwin's time. 佢系达尔文时代嘅一个律师。And to his friends in private correspondence， 根据佢写俾朋友嘅私人信件里边话 ，He wrote that he wanted to liberate geology from Moses。佢想将地质学同埋圣经分翻开。Because in his day, geologists could see the evidence for the flood everywhere. 因为喺佢嘅年代，地质学家可以喺周围都见到大洪水嘅证据。In other words, it was a conscious attempt to undermine the Bible. 换句话嚟讲，佢系有意去贬低圣经嘅。This new philosophy said that you were only allowed to explain things using present-day processes, things happening today. 呢、这个新哲学系你只可以用现有嘅经验去解释事物。Which means that if you see a layer of sandstone many meters thick， 即系话如果你见到一层沙岩有几米咁厚 ，because most rivers today are only laying down a little bit of sand at the bottom of each river， 因为今日大部分嘅河流只会喺河床里边放低少量嘅沙石。That thick sandstone must have taken millions of years to form. 嗰层咁厚嘅沙岩一定要经过几千万年先至可以形成。But there are patterns in the rock record that could not have been from the sorts of things you see today. 喺岩石样本里边有啲排列系今日唔可能会发生嘅。For example, there is a big layer of rock around the Grand Canyon. 例如，围绕住大峡谷有一层好大规模嘅岩层 ，which extends to cover huge areas of the United States， 喺美国伸延同埋覆盖一个好大嘅范围 ，over five hundred thousand square kilometers， 超过五十万平方公里 ，and it's perfectly flat all the way， 系完全咁平坦嘅 ，that is made of sand laid down by water。呢啲系由水流带动而放低嘅沙而形成嘅。There are no rivers building anything like that today。喺现在呢个世代，系冇一条河流可以做到呢一个现象出嚟。There is another layer in that region。喺同一个区域有另一层嘅岩层。And it is called the Sheena Rump。系叫做粉沙岩。And it is made of a special rock called conglomerate。系由一种特别嘅石头叫做砾岩所造成嘅。This happens when water picks up lots of rocks and boulders。咁系当水冲起咗好多石头同埋卵石而形成嘅。Carries them and dumps them。携带起佢哋同埋抌低佢哋啊。And then they get cemented together。然后佢哋凝固埋一齐。Now we do see conglomerate forming today。我哋今日都会见到砾岩嘅形成，但只系一个好细嘅数目，同埋只系喺河道泛滥嘅时候先会出现。因为只有喺嗰个时间，河水先有足够嘅力量。因为只有喺嗰个时间，河水先有足够嘅力量。To be able to pick up stones， 去拎起啲石头 ，and carry them like that。好似之前咁讲，带住佢哋走。But this Sheena Rump extends two hundred and fifty thousand square kilometers。嗰层嘅粉沙岩延伸到二十五万个平方公里。It is hard to imagine how anything other than a global flood。如果唔系一个全球性嘅大洪水，我哋好难想象到点样会形成。Could have carried all those rocks。能够带住咁多嘅石头。In Australia, we have a whole mountain range made of those sorts of rocks. 喺澳洲，我哋有一系列嘅山脉系由粉沙岩所造成嘅。And you can show from seismic echoes, from earthquake echoes. 我哋用地震回音方法。You can tell that these rocks extend 
kilometers deep underground. 你就知道呢啲石喺地下延伸几公里深。And all of it consists of big rocks cemented together. 当中包括一啲大嘅石头凝固埋一齐。That's one of our geologists. 呢个系我哋其中嘅一个地质学家。Dr. Walker. Walker 博士。And from top to bottom. 由顶到底。All of these mountains are made of those rocks. 呢一啲山脉全部都系由同一种石所形成。Again, it is impossible to imagine anything other than a global flood that could have carried this volume of such big rocks. 再一次，除咗全球洪水之外，我真系好难想象会有啲乜嘢嘅力量可以带动到咁大量嘅大石。And here is another thing that shows that the layers were formed quickly. 呢度系另一个例子，话俾大家听，啲岩层系用一个好快速度嚟形成嘅。This is a diagram of a part of the Grand Canyon。呢个图系大峡谷嘅一部分。And this shows signs that the Earth moved。呢度显示咗地壳曾经喐过。And when it did that, it bent all of these layers together。当佢喐动，就将咁多岩层一齐扭曲。Now this Top layer is supposed to be 300 million years younger than the bottom one. 顶层嘅岩层比底层嘅岩层系年轻三亿年。So there's plenty of time for the bottom one to become hard. 所以有足够时间俾底嗰层去变硬。But all of these rocks are bent together without breaking. 但系呢度所有岩层都一齐被扭曲，但系冇折断。Indicating that they were all soft together. 代表咗佢哋扭曲嘅时候，仍然都系柔软。Which makes sense if they were laid within a few weeks or months of each other。如果佢哋系喺几星期或者几个月内形成，咁就好合理啦。Here is an actual photograph of that area。呢张系嗰个地方嘅真实图片。You can see how big this is from these pictures of the people。当你同相里边嘅人比较。你就会睇到呢个地方系有几大。And here is another example from a different part of America。呢度系喺美国嘅另一个例子。And here is an example from New Zealand。呢度系喺纽西兰嘅一个例子。